what struggles did you go through with bullying and all that? So I was bullied physically and mentally um, in year five, so two years ago now, and also year four. And it was, it made me feel alone as such, even though I did have other friends. I wish there was a movie like Dear Laura that I could have watched then. That would have been really helpful. So yeah, um, it was it was just a really tough time to go through and I was very young as well and I still am, um, but I was only 10, uh, 9 and 10 when that happened and um, yeah, I think I realised when I started working on Dear Laura that lots of the people working on Dear Laura have been through a similar thing or worse or or just want to help change the story, like share the story, sorry. So it made me feel really good, like that there's other people out there that went through the same sort of thing. I think there was um, this girl who, when I was in year five, she would like, when I would try and tell the teachers and the staff at my school that she had done certain things to me, she would always lie about it and then she would get her mother involved and her mum would get, like the law involved with it because her mum was a lawyer and so she was kind of putting the blame all back on me which made me feel a lot worse I guess um but yeah so she would do things like push me and kick me and shove me and that sort of thing and I guess <laughs> uh my mum was the assistant principal of my school at the time so, um, but I couldn't really go to her because then her mum would claim that that was favouritism and that sort of thing, which was kind of really hard on me because then I felt like I didn't really have anyone to go to. And my dad would always come to the meetings at the principal's office with me and that sort of thing. But it got to a point where I just couldn't do that and I just didn't want to go to school and my mum had to force me into the classroom in the mornings. And so, yeah, it was really hard. And then other people would kind of make fun of me in saying like, oh, why do you always come into the classrooms in the morning crying? Why do you always have to have your mum walk, to, to walk you to the class? And that made me feel even worse, even though I was already feeling pretty bad.